sunny. Now let's talk for a moment, okay? So we all clearly know what Beanie Boos are, right? I mean, I'm holding a Beanie Boo right now. If it has a tag on it, and you know, you, you can just tell what a Beanie Boo looks like right away, right? But, you guys, there's a secret that I, well, well, actually, it's not even a secret at all, but it's something that I just have to share with you. There are Beanie Boo imposters out there. And they're called the Beanie Boo Prototypes. You've probably seen these all over the market. They're just basically fake Beanie Boos. They weren't made by Ty. Most of them, like, they don't have a Beanie Boo tag. And if they, and if you do see, like, something that does look like a Beanie Boo and has a Beanie Boo tag on it, it doesn't mean it's a Beanie Boo. Like, they could have just snapped one of these off of a real Beanie Boo and just sewed it on. And then they trick you into buying it. Evil imposters will not get away with this. But actually, a lot of them are quite cute. But they still don't meet the Beanie Boo expectations. So today, we're going to be reviewing some Beanie Boo prototypes. These are the hottest, the juiciest, the slickest Beanie Boos on the market. Well, Beanie Boo quote unquote. Fake, disgusting prototypes. And they're not made by Ty. I mean, I don't know why anyone had the nerve to make these. They, they, they can't even make it look like like a Beanie Boo. Each one of these, they don't look 100% like a Beanie Boo. They don't have that Beanie Boo-ness in them. Like, come on, guys, who are making these prototypes. Just do it right. Do it right, just do it. Do it right, just do it. Do it right, just do it. Just do it right, just do it. Just do it, just do it right, do it right, yeah. I hope you enjoy this selection, which is dedicated to these people that made these prototypes. It's called Do It Right, because that's what these people have to do. So without further ado, let's do it right. Wait, right, just do it. Do it right, just do it. Just do it right, do it right. Oh my gosh, I actually really like that song. <laughs> oh, okay, let's get into it already. And the first prototype is this Beanie Boo Labrador. I think it's supposed to be a golden retriever actually i don't know but anyways it's just a little it's a little creepy i don't know it just it just doesn't look right it doesn't look like a beanie boo um i think the colors are nice but oh i don't know why it just it just looks weird and the next one is a wannabe tala <gasps> Yeah, this one does kind of look like Tala, and I don't know if they intended to do that, but it, it I think I think they did. And I, I think it's cute, it's just wannabe Tala though, so, mmm, I don't know if that's that cute. I think, I still think Tala looks better. This one's still cute, but Tala, you will always be better. Just do it right, do it right. And the next prototype is this little pink cat. And I actually really like this one. It's, I love it. I, I mean, I love the colors and she looks like a strawberry to me. <laughs> I don't know why, but she, she looks like a strawberry. And um, I like that this one's like not copying anyone or it doesn't look similar. So, you know, that's nice. And I like the stripes. I think you could use like a little white stomach area. I think that would make it more right. The next one is this Siamese cat, and I actually really like this one. I like the white fur and the purple ears, and I like the pink nose. I think this actually does look quite like a Beanie Boo, so I think this could pass the Beanie Boo test. I actually think this does look like a Beanie Boo. This is probably my favorite out of all of them. It is super cute, and I love it. 
<gasps> I love it. I love it. I love it. It is so cute and it's cute and I love it. 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 I love the pink nose. I love the pink eyes. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love the black paws. I love it. This one looks like it's copying Halo the bear and I'd say it looks rather uncomfortable. I don't think this bear would pass. It actually looks kind of creepy and ugh, it just looks kind of like a superhero. I hate it. And now we have this really, really cute bird, and I love this one. I think this one's absolutely adorable. I love the colors. I love the green and the baby blue and the yellow. I think it works really nicely together. It makes this mini boo really so cute, and I love it. <laughs> but I will admit, it does look a little weird with two like little toes i think that they probably should have made three toes on a foot not two it looks a little weird and funny but otherwise this beanie boo is oh, oh my geez it's so good that i called it a beanie boo wow Now, this one's weird. It's a bright, bright, bright neon pink cat. This one I don't really like. It's, ugh, the colors. I'm not a big fan of this neon pink for a cat. It just doesn't work, and I don't like it paired with this taxi blue, and ugh. This one, it's not. I don't think this is good at all. Ooh, no, no, no. And we're back to the wannabes. This one is a wannabe original peanut, except it is not cute. I think original peanut is so cute. Like, just look at his little face. He's so cute. But this one, ugh, like, its fur is all weird. And it has, like, whatever the lighting is, the lighting makes it look shiny and greasy. I don't really like this one. I don't think the colors work together well. And... It's just original peanut. The real original peanut is much better. Oh my gosh, it's a wannabe bananas. Oh my gosh, I bet so many people could get fooled by this prototype of bananas. Ugh, no, please do not fall for it. It is not bananas. No, no, no. This one is a really weird, funky, colorful goat. And hey, there's room for a colorful goat in the Beanie Boo collection, but just not this way. This way, ooh, ugh, no, 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 no. This just doesn't work. Oh, there's even more wannabes by the minute. This one, I believe, is supposed to be a wannabe Leona. It just looks like it, and ooh, no, no, no. This one, it's it's just so plain. There's nothing that cool about it. This one's not really eye-catching. Leona is much better, and Shlom are classic. This one is, ooh, this one ain't classic. This one, weird. This one is a very interesting recreation of, I believe, they're trying to recreate Tracy. It's a wannabe Tracy. There are so many wannabe Beanie Boos. Beanie Boo prototypes, quote unquote Beanie Boo. And this one, mm, it's just not cool. It's like Tracy, but without her bow. Ugh, this is Tracy when she's angry. And we're back with another neon cat. This time, it's a bright, oh, I was about to say pink, bright green neon cat with this pink in the ear and the eyes. This is just super weird, just like the bright pink one. No, 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 no. And now we have a koala, which... I mean, it's cute and everything. I think it would look really nice if Ty could just tweak a few things. The nose looks a little too polished and slippery and I think it just needs more texture like the rest of the Mini Boo Koalas, but I think this one's good overall. Stop laughing, that's not funny. 
Now, this one's weird. Now, I don't know why, but this poodle, it just looks super weird. The colors, and with this white, like, skin stuff, the skin of the poodle, this is like a shaved poodle. It's, like, orange on top of the head, makes it look like a redhead, which, nothing wrong with redheads, just, you know, something. And then this pink and this bright yellow, it reminds me of paint. I don't know why it reminds me of paint. It looks like she stepped in a bunch of paint. Oh, this one's bad. This one's really bad. And next up, we have scaly unicorns, which is super weird. This is, ugh. She looks like a snake with snake skin. I mean, it's an interesting thought. Very interesting. But, I, ugh. I don't know. I don't know. Let, let's give this one a break. And this one has like a tie tag on it, but I'm pretty sure this isn't a real beanie boo. This prototype is a mouse, I believe, and this one's actually really cute. It kind of looks like a flying squirrel, just the position of the feet, but this one's really cute. I actually like this one. Another interesting beanie boo. This one kind of, oh, <laughs> beanie boo. I keep calling these beanie boos. These are prototypes. This one kind of looks like Tabitha, and I think this one is actually quite cool. It just kind of looks weird with gray ears i don't know why they made the ears gray which is a different color than the body it's just a weird choice but otherwise this one's cute and now we have a wannabe phantom but he's orange and this is a really weird color i mean we do have a beanie boo um ghost that is orange and he's really cute um his name's Ghouly. Um, but this just does not look right. He looks like a, I don't know, he looks like a peach. <laughs> and now we have this purple owl, which this one actually looks really cute. I like the colors. I love the purple and orange. I think they go well together, <laughs> together nicely. Um, but she looks, uh, dare I say it, sad? And now for the colorful monkey. Now this colorful monkey looks really creepy inside of his box than if he were out of his box. He just looks really ugh, creepy and uh, the colors make him look even more creepy. This, no, this one isn't cute in my opinion. Mm -mm. Wannabe cashmere. Now this one does look really alike to cashmere. But it's not cashmere. Don't be fooled by the cute factor of it. It's not cashmere. Not cashmere. Wannabe. <laughs> wannabe slush. This one is a wannabe slush who has green in his ears. And it looks like felt. It just looks super cheap. And also kind of looks like Skylar. And of course, saving the creepiest for last, this is a naked turtle. And on the back of it, there may be a shell, but from the front, nakedness. And it's a wannabe Shelby. It looks really creepy. It looks like a hairless elf. Ooh, I don't like this one. This one's really, really creepy. It's, it's naked. I like it, but not a lot. I don't like it. Were those Beanie Boo prototypes interesting or what? Actually, they were pretty funny to me. They all are... Uh, they all have something special about them that I, I can't help but to admire it. So these were the hottest Beanie Boos on the market. The juiciest, the slickest. <laughs> yummy tasty beanie boos and um yeah i wonder which one was your favorite mine oh they're all too juicy i think i've made my point these people that made these prototypes really need to do it right do it right <laughs>
actually stop with that song stop 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 anyways you guys thank you so much for watching this video please smash that subscribe button no 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 i'm not one of those people i'm not gonna ask you to subscribe i'm just gonna say thank you for watching this video and if you want to subscribe go ahead if you don't well then Darn you. Darn you all to heck. That's right, if you don't subscribe, darn you to heck. Thank you so much for watching this interesting video, and I'll see you next time in my next interesting video. So, bye guys. Yeah.